everybody. I feel weird not saying that with an English accent, but you know, whatever. Hope everyone had a really great weekend. For those of you that went after the Yeezy Boost 700 Wave Runner and hit, congratulations. I heard it was kind of a tough weekend for those of you trying to get it. Um, I did manage to get a pair off of Adidas US. Heard uh, a lot of people's orders on Yeezy Supply got canceled, so it's kind of a bummer, but I hope you got at least one pair if you were going after them. Pretty cool. That'll probably be, a, be in a haul series eventually. But uh, regardless, I hope you had a great weekend. Subscribers, welcome back. <laughs> Thank you guys and gals so much for tuning in, taking the time out of your busy day to watch me ramble about shoes, Supreme, other dumb things that really don't matter in the end. For those of you who do not subscribe, hello, my name is Mitchell. I am probably your least favorite PG YouTube and moron, and I'm going to stay that way because that's how I've always been, and I'm stubborn because I'm old. I unbox things here on my YouTube channel, mostly sneaker related, sometimes hype items and street wear. If you enjoy this video and you make it all the way through, I hope you smash that subscribe button become a pal we're all pals here so you can join us and watch dumb videos and laugh at dad jokes and make lots of mistakes about things that i pretend to know a lot about so without further ado let's jump right into haul series number 23. <laughs> So I actually got quite a few things in this haul, so I'm not gonna I'm not gonna waste any time. So we're just gonna jump right in. This first thing I got is from Zappos.com shoe company shoe website thing. They had a restock on a Vans that's actually turned out to be kind of tricky to get. I only have one pair of Vans. I have the Vans North Face collaboration. Big fan of that. This is it's an old school. It's a size 11. If you can read it, it says Yacht Club on it. I'm very excited about these because you guys might know if you've watched me a couple times that I'm a huge fan of weird colorways and these are definitely a weird colorway. So these are called Yacht Club. I think the premise on these, they're called Yacht Club because the color blocking that's going on here is very nautical themed. And I just noticed, I, I've never seen this before. These laces are kind of rope themed, like, like, <laughs> That's actually really kind of cool because you use a rope on a, on a ship or a schooner. Regardless, these are my size and I'm probably keeping these. I really like these. I'm a fan of the fact that there's just bright colors and check those out. Those are pretty cool. Really happy about those. Zappos is just a regular shoe company that you can get stuff on. These, I mean, they're sold out everywhere. I mean, there's nowhere to find them. I, I don't know why they're selling so fast. This next one is from from a clothing company based in San Francisco called Huff. I'm a huge fan of the Huff clothing company. Started by Keith Huffnagel. I don't remember when, but Keith Huffnagel was a professional skateboarder. He hung out with the dudes from, from Jackass before they were in Jackass and stuff. And Huff is just, they make really good quality clothing. It's a skateboarding company. I haven't skated in years. I'm sure you guys know this by now, but they did a collaboration with Felix the Cat, which I thought was really cool. So this is actually Felix the Cat on a skateboard and just says Huff. It's a yellow shirt. The nice thing about Huff clothing is the shirts are very soft and really comfortable. So I'm really excited about these. These came out on the first and I made sure that I got this shirt because I don't know if they're still available. They probably are because Huff isn't too hyped, but I'm really happy I got this shirt. So go check them out. Their website is HuffWorldwide.com. Next up, I'm sure you guys know by now, it's back and it's time that we got revisited by the Supreme Donkey. <laughs> these next four items are from Supreme. For those of you that ordered some Supreme in week one, I'm sure a lot of you heard stories Week one was kind of a mess. A lot of people did not get confirmation emails. Some people didn't even get shipping emails. I just got most of this stuff in on the on the week three drop date. So it took quite a bit. I ordered four things. Let's hope that they're all the right things, first of all. So this first one, small box. So it came in a Supreme bag, that's good. There is a little collection of things here. There's some poppy seeds, a skull pile sticker. Looks like a chicken dinner sticker and a chair sticker. So that's actually pretty cool that that came with that. But this is, I think it's the stacking cups, a set of four stacking cups. I'm just hoping they're not broken because my friend Ethan got a bunch in and his were broken. Mine do not appear to be broken, so that's actually really good. But you can see they're stacking cups. Are these plastic or are these ceramic? These are plastic. <laughs> So the fact that his broke is even worse. You stack them up, they stay supreme. You could drink a little coffee in this, that'd be pretty cool. So I didn't get any any confirmation emails from Supreme. So that was kind of a bummer, but 
they, uh, I guess they switched shipping companies, and I guess that's why it's been kind of a mess. I'm glad that one of my four orders was correct. Let's see what else there is. So this is a hoodie, I would assume. Came in a big supreme bag. Let's see if there's a BOGO sticker in here. There's another little pack with a BOGO sticker, what looks to be a Molotov cocktail sticker set, and a Saliva Album Supreme sticker set. So that's really cool. This is a size medium of the Legal Business Controls America hoodie. I don't know if you guys can see, but the screen printing, I don't know if it was meant to be kind of not that great, but it doesn't look like it's that awesome of quality. I don't know if it's intentional. It could be. Gotta look it up. But regardless, there's that. After that, we got another hoodie. This one came in a smaller Supreme bag, and it looks like there's another little sticker pack with Molotovs, a saliva sticker, and the poppy seeds look to be torn open because they're all over the place, so that's okay though. But this one is the corner logo hoodie, which you can tell right there. This is a medium and it is also black. This will be on the website, just like the other stuff, so there's that. That's pretty cool. So we're three for three so far, so that's good. This last one is a really small one. Comes with the BOGO sticker. It's this little fella. This is a Supreme Zippo. It's red. These things do not come with lighter fluid in them because that's illegal to, <laughs> to mail that. But cool. So we are four for four on Supreme orders this week. That's really good. I haven't gotten anything. I didn't get anything week two and I didn't get anything week three. So after that, we got something from a legitimate seller on Twitter. First time doing business with this guy. His Twitter handle is at Cops Not Drops. He is actually a fellow Beater Box member. It says to Senior Papa, because I'm the potato man. It's some poppy seeds, a box logo sticker, and what looks to be more Molotov cocktails. This is from a from a dude. I've known him for a couple months now because we are Beater Box members. Appreciate you, man. This next one we got here is from another supremely legitimate dude on Twitter. I've done business with this cat, it seems like five billion times. He's hilarious. Big fan of his. His Twitter handle is at SSBK1881. We just call him SS. Very fitting I got this from him because his Twitter avatar is a monkey and it's a bathing ape. It's a Dame 4, I'm sure you guys know. It's a size 13, he gave me a really good price on this. I guess he got it from StockX. Yeah, because there's a bunch of StockX stuff on here, so. There's that, big foot size, I have another pair of these in the same size, so. I'm holding these because I think they're just gonna ra or they're just gonna rise in value because there was a lot of, there were a lot of releases in February and early March, so. Thank you, SS. Supremely awesome dude, big fan of his. Check him out, his Twitter handle is at SSBK1881. This next one I got from a guy that was on the last haul video. His Twitter handle is at MustangMan8793. Really good dude. He gave me a ridiculous deal on these. I think he just needed them gone, but look at this. Look at all this packing material. But this is a really good size, size 11 and a half. It's a Jordan 1 if you can't tell by the box. This is a pair of the recently, recently released bread toes. The leather on these is super soft. It's, these are a really nice pair. I have a pair of my own for personal wear. These are going to be on the website in case anyone is 11 and a half and wants to get a pair of bread toes. So check out the dude I got these from. His Twitter handle is at MustangMan8793. Really good dude. His display name is SneakerMan. And then lastly, probably the person that you'll see on my channel more often than not. This is from SuperPal. Drone Kicks. Packing material. It's a common thing to see now with him. But this is a really good size too, size 10 and a half. It's a Jordan 1 as you can tell. This is a pair of Jordan 1 gold toes. I don't know what happened. For some reason, when they got to him, they did not have the lace bags attached, which is totally fine. They're still new, no one's ever worn them before. And if you're gonna get them, you're probably gonna wear them. But this is size 10 and a half. Shipped them quick, shipped them secure, secure. gave me a great deal. I I'm super pumped. Thank you, Drone. Everyone check him out on Twitter. His handle is at Drone Kicks, just an amazing fella. We talk daily, we do a lot of business. We should probably get each other punch cards with how often we buy stuff from each other, but really good dude, give him a follow on Twitter. So, there it is, haul series number 23. Thank you guys for watching. Really quick, Brick 66 is still going on. Everything ends on Thursday, so get your bids in. If you don't know what Brick 66 is, go to my website, ransomnotesneakers.com or rnsmnote.com if you're feeling fast. You can click on the Brick 66 menu and find out what it is. It's basically a cheap way to get some shoes on eBay. So check that out. Everything ends on Thursday at 7 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I will ship same or next day. 
depending on when you pay. So check that out. If you do decide you want to buy something on there, you end up winning the auction, make sure that you message me before paying and I will give you $10 off your order for being a, for being a pal of the SB Mitch YouTube channel. So check that out. It's ebay.com slash USR slash ransom note. Subscribers, thank you guys and gals for coming back so much. If you do not subscribe, I hope you made it through this video. And we'll hit the subscribe button and become a pal. Because we're all pals here. So I will have a video for you within the next couple days, I would imagine. Don't know what it's going to be about. Don't know when it's going to be. But it's going to be something. So till then, take care of yourself. Take care of each other. Remember, they're just shoes. If you're not having fun doing it, find something you love doing and do that. Because it's the easiest way to be happy. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Thank <laughs> you.